conquering Constantinople losing to Bulgaria the Latin Empire's story. In the early 13th century, the Byzantine Empire was at a crossroads. After centuries of power and influence, the once mighty empire was on the decline. Its armies were weak, its treasury depleted, and its rulers were constantly fighting among themselves. It was at this time that the Fourth Crusade arrived in Constantinople. The Crusaders had been tasked with retaking the Holy Land from the Muslims, but instead, they turned their attention to the wealthy Byzantine Empire. In 1204, after a month's long siege, the Crusaders breached the walls of Constantinople and sacked the city. They established the Latin Empire, with Constantinople as its capital, and installed a series of French and Italian nobles as its rulers. The Latin Empire lasted for just over 50 years, during which time it struggled to maintain control over its vast territories. Its rulers were often at odds with each other, and the empire was constantly threatened by external enemies. One of these enemies was the Bulgarian Empire, which was expanding rapidly in the early 13th century. In 1205, just one year after the establishment of the Latin Empire, the Bulgarian Tsar Khalin launched an attack on Constantinople. The Latin forces were no match for the Bulgarian army, and in 1205 they suffered a crushing defeat at the Battle of Adrianople. The Bulgarian victory was a major blow to the Latin Empire, which was forced to cede control of several key territories. But the Latin Empire's troubles didn't end there. In 1261, the Nicaean Empire, a successor state to the Byzantine Empire, launched a surprise attack on Constantinople and retook the city. The Latin Empire was reduced to a rump state, and its remaining territories were gradually absorbed by the Byzantine successor states. The Latin Empire's short time of glory serves as a cautionary tale about the consequences of money, ambition, and infighting. Despite the might and riches of the empire, it was eventually unable to take Constantinople, and it fell prey to the same causes that had brought down the Byzantine Empire before it. The Fourth Crusade was a key event in medieval history, and its diversion to Constantinople and the subsequent foundation of the Latin Empire had long-lasting consequences for the area. The Byzantine Empire, which had been devastated by decades of struggle, was struck a death blow by the Fourth Crusade. The Latin Empire, on the other hand, was a young empire with a varied population and a complicated political scene. The Latin Empire was created in Constantinople in 1204 after the Fourth Crusade had devastated the city. The Crusaders had been promised money by the Byzantine Emperor, but when the cash was not forthcoming, they took things into their own hands and devastated the city. The formation of the Latin Empire was a direct consequence of this invasion, and it marked the beginning of a new period in the history of the area. The Latin Empire was controlled by a succession of French and Italian lords who had been appointed as its rulers by the Crusaders. These kings were frequently at war with one another, and the empire was continuously endangered by foreign adversaries. One of these adversaries was the Bulgarian Empire, which was developing quickly in the early 